Hey guys, welcome back to Philly Thrills. And today we will be counting down my top 10 favorite elements on El Toro. And I got this idea from Micah from Coaster Frenzy. Go check out his videos. He makes some really good videos. So let's get right into it. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Boys. Number 10, we have the Step Up Airtime Hill right before the Rolling Thunder Hill. Now, this will give you a pretty good quick pop of flowjector if you're in one of the front rows, but if you're in one of the back rows, you literally get nothing. That's why it's so low on my list. But hey, I guess it beat the turnaround out of the station and the turnaround before the drop, so I guess that's something. So coming in at number nine, we have the final twisted airtime hill right before the break run. Now, this is a decently good element. I mean, it's kind of cool how you're banking one way and then you get a you get a little floater moment and then you're banking the other way. It's pretty cool, but it's kind of short and not that strong. So that's why it's at number nine. Coming to you at number eight, we have the first twisted airtime hill before the second one. Now this one is just a little bit bigger and it's a little bit more banked on each side. So it's a little bit stronger airtime and they're almost the same, but I'd say this one's just a little bit better. So that's why it's better than the other one. So coming in at number seven, we have the banked airtime hill. Now this is the one right after the turnaround where you bank up, where you're banking like to the right, going up into it, and then you drop back down. Now this element is pretty good. There's some laterals going up it, which is pretty fun. And then a nice good floater drop after that. It's a pretty fun element. It's better than most elements on other wooden roller coasters, which is just showing you how good El Toro is. It's just such a great ride. So let's move on. At number six, we have the sustained floater hill after the element I just told you guys about in number seven. Now this is a really fun element. It's like, Benham Hyper Floater Airtime, but on a small scale. It's kind of like a speed hill in a way, but it has like Benham Hyper type floater airtime and it's just really cool and it's such a fun moment on the ride. Coming in at number five, we have the banked turnaround. Now you go up into this, like one of the camelbacks, you get a sharp pop of ejector and then you get flung to the right as you're banked downwards during the turnaround and you just get crazy laterals. This is just such a fun moment of the ride. It's so crazy. And this is just why I love this ride so much, just because of how insane it is. So coming in at number four, we have the three back to back to back bank turns after the rolling thunder hill. These things are so intense. It's so hard to keep your hand up and they kind of beat you up too. So it's just awesome. They're just so intense. And then you're just going one way and then all of a sudden you're banking the other way and it's so intense and crazy. Coming in at number three is the first drop. Now this is probably the best first drop I've ever experienced on any coaster, period. This drop is so amazing. In the back row, it's super strong, sustained ejector the whole way down. And it's just such a good first drop. At number two, we have the back to back camelbacks these are so huge and you get super strong sustained ejector airtime on both of these and of course the fart noise is just amazing and they're so 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 strong they're like twisted timbers triple back to back to back airtime mills but stronger and only two my favorite element of all time on El Toro has to be the Rolling Thunder Hill. You go up this thing, you go banking upwards and it's just super intense and weird feeling. And then you have this super sharp, just crest and drop and it's crazy. It's so powerful. Strongest airtime moment I've experienced in my life. It's just such a great element. 
thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed. Please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Peace.